I wasn't born with a, a brush in my hand. It took quite a long time before I decided that I wanted to be a mixed media artist. My career was in marketing and communications and writing. I actually did a series for the Phoenician Resort that, that's still being published today. And I think it was through that series where I was working with uh, photography, my husband's photography actually, um, <clears throat> and photo illustrating them that I became seriously interested in photography. I had a love of photography when I was a child and so I felt like I've circled back to studying photography and becoming a mixed media artist. What I love about my mixed media is that <clears throat> there are no rules. I love to use luxurious materials like dye bond aluminum and acrylic <clears throat> and I love hand finishing pieces with all sorts of natural elements from grasses to rocks and there really is there's really no limit to what I can explore and find and use and to bring something beautiful to life. I hope that I really influence people with with my work with happiness. I am not afraid of color, if you can see on the wall. And, and I really am a very happy person. I am not one of these tormented artists. And I want my joy to come through my artwork and, and bring happiness to other people. I think the evolution of my art is very layered, just like my art. <clears throat> In my artwork, which starts with uh, a print on a dye bond aluminum or Sintra, which is another material, <clears throat> and then I layer different elements on top of it. I think my, my career has, has just been just like my art, very layered and very nuanced. Each piece that I start with gives me something different. There's a different mood depending on the colors and the design. And sometimes what I'm doing is quite planned, and other, other times there's quite a lot of serendipity, I would say. So there's a little bit of mystery to the process, <clears throat> but I usually have a, a master plan and follow that, uh, and then let the creative spirits take me, take me away. The celebration of fine arts is very, very meaningful to me. I have been a visitor for many, many years, and I have always loved the show. I would walk up and down the aisles for hours at a time with my parents and just loved it. And it was always a dream for me to one day apply. And a couple of years ago, I got up the courage to do it and finally did, and here I am. So this is a dream come true, being at the celebration of fine art.